Hey guys, Smooth Comics here. Talk about hiding your tropes. I know I haven't done an art and talk video in quite a while, but I'm making up for it now. You want to hide your tropes when making your story in order to prevent being predictable. In modern times, every story has already been told. So, whether you, so what we do now is that we tell the same stories over and over, but we hide it so that it feels a bit different each time. Now, think of shows, for example, Star Wars. Star Wars is incredibly influential, but when you look at it, it's really just the same thing we've already seen. You gotta rescue the princess, all that, except it's in space. But you don't notice that at first glance. When I was a kid watching Star Wars, I didn't really see the connection between, between Star Wars and basically Hamlet. Then I figured... Then I found out later it was, but it was so cleverly made, so cleverly hidden that you don't notice it. And as for Switch the Gender Ninja here, Switch is obviously a warrior from another world story. You know, like this warrior comes from some old civilization, some ancient civilization other than Earth, and they have to fight to protect humanity and stuff. Now here's a difference between Switch. Here, it's not a fish out of water story. Switch has been around for a long time. Switch knows how humanity works. And Switch is not learning about humanity for the first time. Switch has been around. But at its core, it's still just a warrior from another world story. Now, that's the difference between Switch and other warriors from other world stories. But even then, is it that much of a difference? See, at the end of the day, Switch is still shown to be... Uh, what, what's it called? When you're, xenophobic. Switch is xenophobic towards humans, something that's highlighted in the story a lot. So at the end of the day, does it really make much of a difference? See, that's how you hide a trope. <laughs> Making you feel as... You don't notice it until it's too late. You're already sucked in. Sorry if I'm not talking that much. I still have to focus on the art itself. And a lot of people, you could criticize me in my in-between frames. That's just how, if you're an artist getting started, in-between frames always look wonky. That's how they always look. Don't worry about spoilers. No, I have yet to... A lot of y'all question... If you're showing me make the comic, aren't, aren't you going to get spoiled? No, you will not get spoiled. I assure you that. Because I haven't even... We haven't even gotten anywhere near the spoiler heavy territory when it comes to Switch Gender Ninja. So, in regards of hiding tropes, make sure. Just overlook what you're trying to do. Look at the traditional tropes. You've got the, I just got my powers. You know, the random guy gets powers of nothing. You know, that trope. 
Well, how about you do that same thing, except they plan for it their whole life. They went through some special trial younger throughout their whole life, and they achieved this until they finally got their power. But it wasn't what they expected or something. So you can play with the tropes. At the end of the day, Switch is a warrior from another world. But it doesn't have to be a... It doesn't necessarily have to be a a fish out of water story. Yes, he's a warrior from another world, but does he have to be a fish out of water? Not necessarily. Make sense. I can hear some noise in the background. Uh, friends visiting. As uh, by the way, I'm gonna start a new series soon of. Of manga versus comic books. I'm going to compare and contrast how compare and contrast how manga works and how anime works, and just the tropes between them. How 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 they similar? How they're different? I'm going to start the series like that. A lot of people say. That, that manga always has better fight scenes. I wouldn't say always. I think Western comics are very underrated when it comes to fights. People don't give Western comics the respect they deserve when it comes to fights. See you guys later.